Hello, my beautiful Cancerians! Welcome to one of our special readings. As you know, the special readings are timeless readings as well, require requesting by you. And of course, much appreciation for the insights and suggestions. If you have anything in mind, write down in the comments or send us an email so we can look further into what is there for you. Your next 72 hours, what you don't expect, but it's coming. Let's see, loves. What you don't expect that it's coming in such a quick time frame. And timeless reading speaks of whatever you come across, that's the message you gotta see or approach. Let's see, loves. King of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, and Page of Swords, and Six of Swords. There's a lot of swords here, and I feel here there's some kind of like responsibilities, or someone here needs to learn something. And it's not easy for them to, to get used to certain things. For some of you, it could be a person. Could be a situation you are dealing. Let's see, loves. Seven of Swords, another Swords. Woohoo! Hierophant, Taurus energy here. Three of Cups. Yeah, definitely here someone with the time will learn a lesson. Seven of Pentacles. The only major arcana, we have the Hierophant. And Hierophant many times speaks about the teacher. Also speaks about lessons. Yeah, many times we put also the Hierophant as, a, as the card of, you know, marriage, commitment. For some of you, your commitment is tested doesn't necessary to be but what i'm seeing here it's a lesson and it's not an easy lesson it's kind of somebody here gotta take responsibility for what they do or what they say they gotta learn the manners or the the human skills kind of a thing and this is not taken lightly, but with the time you will see if they they can or they cannot. I feel here with the Seven of Swords there's some kind of attempt, but it's more likely this attempt is not going to work. Let's see. Seven of Swords. For some of you, you will learn a lesson in regards someone seven of swords clarifier please four of pentacles yeah somebody here doesn't want to do something but they they will it's kind of like the necessity will make them to learn that or to do that like this person could um, so it could be you, could be someone you are dealing or you've been dealing. Some of you definitely here could be you. The universe wants to teach you a lesson. Whatever it is, if you do something that is not really appropriate, you better learn it. For some of you, it could be a work situation out there. And don't hesitate to learn it. There's no shortcuts. I feel here someone here is like, why you should do this? Why, like, mm -mm, it's not going to work other ways. There also speaks of either it's made the right way, either there is no way. Or it's kind of like either quick and good done either. You will have a lot of time to do it or you... You will, it's like don't waste the time. That's what I'm hearing. Because certain things here is not going to go the way someone thinks will go. 
there's something here this time or this is the only time when really matters yeah nine of wands yeah somebody here doesn't want to do certain things with the nine of wands it's just kind of like no this is not for me I'm not gonna do this it's kind of like do it the right way or how needed otherwise you waste your time where you will waste more time and effort even. Eight of Cups here. It's like whatever here is, it's on you. There's something here on you. The Seven of Pentacles. You know, could be between you and a person, could be between you and your work. Like somebody here is under the magnifying glass. How you do the things, how your moves are. And for some of you, you might know, not knowing that this is happening. So if you are having something like work-related suspicious or... Or things make sure you do the right thing because you don't see this but it's coming and if somebody here try to you know let's say yes I'm coming to work and I do my work but you could sneak out or you could do certain things but not really there's some kind of discipline here done for some of you, it's your person. If you are dealing here with someone and they always do certain things, you put them to discipline or you put them to learn something. And yes, there's kind of uncomfortable. They will try or you will try something else to do. But uh -uh. it's kind of this time is not going to work. And it's kind of also nobody will can cover or nobody will do it anything about it. Yeah, two of swords. Unless someone here allows the things, unless someone here it's, you know, it's going with the flow or works or do the right thing. Because somebody here is just like, you don't see how to or you don't want to see how to. Look at here. Ace of Cups. Some, some of you, you are might be given one month to get better. There's something here in those lines. Eight of Wands. So definitely here, there's something that someone will. We're gonna take a deep dive. There's definitely here some kind of actions somebody here will will put to reflect on. It's kind of like I don't want to do it. I don't want to look into. You know, there's a there's a thing here when you think you you got it all. You gotta be careful how you got it all. Or when you are on the top of the mountain, there might be another bottom of the mountain. So that's kind of a thing here. So definitely here you don't expect this. Especially if it's a work situation here that someone, it's kind of like keeping an eye on you. Or how you do the things. Or you could take an eye or keep an eye on someone. Could be love wise, could be relationship wise, could be even work. Advice we have Ten of Cups, Two of Cups, Four of Wands, Six of Swords, and Nine of Cups. There's something here speaks about the comfort zone. Not everything what seems great 
it's great. Because, you know, in the comfort zone, we're not growing. So there's some kind of effort here needs to be done. And Five of Swords. It's kind of the shortcuts or the things here that the way I do, it's always great or good. is not going to work. Or somebody here might think, like, what I don't do good. Well, see for yourself. That somebody here will say, see for yourself. But definitely here, to, to be everything good, there's something here about get out of your comfort zone. Whatever that speaks to you, darling. What advice from our beautiful oracles? Embrace the in-between. The 26, again, makes the number 8. So there's infinite possibilities to look at the things differently and uh, embrace the in-between really speaks of certain things here are changing and so you if you want will change or will go towards it the abundant universe will provide and you are never alone It's like you you know things could get, go better or could go good. And for some of you, if it's a work situation, it's not only you under the magnifying glass. But there are more than, more than one or two people here. For others of you, there is certain things here definitely are changing for the best. And you're never alone because not only you got to know or learn new things. And there's always enough. Whatever here is doing, it's to the best. Whatever is here, either someone discipline or needs to learn a lesson. Whatever is here, it's to your own good. Or to your own best interest. No matter whatever that is. So yes, darlings, that's what I have for you for the next 72 hours. What you don't expect, but it's coming. Blessings. And let us know how this is for you. See you next time, darlings. Namaste.